pe family mo si asi a ko ha fe pe atawa ko kamata ya ko o si a fe ilo aki ta bun di levai ai ko mate ta kamata ai ai o wa wa ko e malanga fa o si ko no inga o pia ye ba ka tuli ki ai e parestemi ya fe ma o pe ke ta tuli tuli ki ai ko ya mo kataki Ah, fakat to o mai. Ah, ko ne ha fe pe ta hawa. Ko ne o am ta punia kata ki pe. Ko inga ko e. Ko e ko e tan te pire a e. Palestine a Malakai. Ya. Ah. Ka pa o ki ai han i en. He ko si o tu ke ki u mai tu a ku lo lo. Ke fakat to o mai. Kita ini kata kie, tu mesti tetafa.
Hallelujah. Let us give our hands to the Lord and welcome the Holy Spirit this morning. Hallelujah. Father, through Jesus Christ, our Savior, our Redeemer, our salvation, we dedicate the program we're going through this morning. We give you glory and honor in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Tapu pea moe tolu taha i o tua. Pea moe lau maari e, o kune a fio yo taulo tolo tonga. Whatapu ki e whanau, moe whaa moe puna hau e, ka maha tau i whonua. Whatapu ki e kau taula e ki, maha loti. Pege whatapu ki e whahu, Fakta pun mak eh ki he sin no kere kere kau ya. Oh five fe kau malakai bay pulu. Kau pe he ki he witau, pe mau fana upaya. Fakta pun ki he salah pe mau bulangi. Inau tol kotor apa lo kunau hufia ay mal mal lo farikoni. Kau tala mau kapu ya tiaw. Kaya tamua ke fahoko e tau fa famis i he pongpongin. I know those of you can wait for the matematonga. No one can stop you when you jump and clap your hands and you shout what the player they play in the field. But this morning, why not? Why we not give our hands, another hands for Malakai? Give our hands for <laughs> Reverend Malakai Daifun. He run his race and he finish his course. He never ever pass his course or his race to someone else to finish. He fights the good fight of faith. He run his race and he finished his course and he kept his faith. Amen. Give another hands to the Lord. <laughs> Hallelujah. Please, raise to your feet. This is the day the Lord has made. You will rejoice. I will rejoice. We will rejoice. And be glad in it. Hallelujah. Psalm 118 and verse 24. Brother and sister, this morning, the presence of God is here. Hallelujah. It's up to you. You set you free. Second Corinthians chapter 3, verse 17. The place where the Spirit is, there is a free in that place. It's good for you to clap your hands. You shout to the Lord. And you do what the Lord has done in your life and my life. So I came into the pen to bring, give us another song. The song of a rejoice. Shout to the Lord. Clap your hands on nation and shout to the Lord with joy. Psalm 47 verse 1. So I handed over to the pen to give us a rejoicing, a song of joy, to praise and worship God this morning. Hallelujah. Yeah.
Oh, <coughs> Pe ka pau e fuaki e hatangata a koloa kotoa pe o hono fare kane mau ai o fa e lau pe ia o e mea wa inga ka vita ake e ki Eson Ko <coughs> Kalafi o Malakai by Pulu, Mehaka Matala. Kiki Hoko to Ben, Kalafi o Malakai by Pulu, Mehaka Matala. Nayo mai Daniela Mafua, he po fa ka family. Ko malakai vai pulu, na fa le ia he ahonima, tisema da hiwa ni ma balu. He au ia ke foki ki api he aho hiwa sune wafe wawa. Ko malakai vai pulu, na tu puya he o mama tua ko sione lupe me kolonga vai pulu me felemea mo makawe. Mosiosi vai pulu o pea Komalakai vai pulu, nai tu puya e faanau e toko taha taha. Pelahi taha ko pelinta vai pulu, nai malia ka te osio o siapani, o iai e faanau e toko fa. Hoko ki ai ko hapakuki vai pulu, malia ka e sta ta kai o ohonua, o iai e na faanau e toko nimu. Hoko ki ai Ko te vita ula vai pulu neke ne pekia ke pe pe pe. Hoko ki ai malakai vai pulu ke pekia ye ahoni ne malia mo ana tu po mau o kolo mai le ewa. Pe ai e na fa nau e toko fa o fa nau ohi e toko ua. Hoko ki ai ko inai se vai pulu malia mo tau fa tobi o ha pai i ai e fa nau e toko fitu. Hoko ki ai, ko minewa vai pulu, malia mo makeleta, o vai ni o iai e faanau e tokotoa. 
Hoko kiai ko Daniela Mafua Vaipulu, na Malia Movika, o Ovaka, o Iai, e na Fanao, e Tokonima. Hoko kiai ko Ana Manatu Fonua, na Pusi Aki, e na Ata, ko e na Umehitanga, o Iai, e Fanao, e Tokotolu. Hoko kiai ko Ana Folao Vaipulu, na Malia Mojim Shek Khan, o Pakistani, o Iai, e na Fanao, e Tokotolu. Hoko kiai ko te evita vai pulu vaka, ne pusi e kia i lai saane ko nao mehitanga, mali mo mele e glismasi o houma, o iai e na whanau e toko tolu. Hoko kiai a kapeta a fifita, mali mo saalote, o matahau iai e na whanau e toko tolu. Ko malakai vai pulu, ne mali mo ana tu poumau o kolomaile e ua, o iai e na whanau e toko fa. Ko lahitaha, ko lisiate, lo to i laione, vai pulu, ne pekia, ke i pepe. Hoko ki ai, ko seo si ana, vai pulu. Hoko ki ai, ko i lai saane, whakakana, ai langi, vai pulu. Ve hoko ki ai, ko si si taha, ko i naise, vai pulu. Ne i ai, mo i whana wohi, e toko ua, ko lo saline, o wafi. Ne i mali, mo tule wa asiata, o i ai, e na whanao, e toko ono. Pe hoko ki ai, he whana wohi ko lisiate lo to i laione tawalupe, mali mo Katrina, o i ai e na whanao e toko tolu. Na iako a malakai vai pulu i GPS havelu loto pe, pe a hua ai ke ko lisi tau whahau mo pilolewu i pangai ha apai. Pe hoko atu e ne ako ki he apiako a te nisi in situ. Na e tali e malakai vai pulu e eiki, ko si suka lai si ki hono loto e he aho taha taha a gosi ua hafe maua. Na e me mipa he siasi North Shore Tongan Assemblies of God o hoko ko i tīkoni i he siasi. Pe ne tali ai e aui a eiki ke hoko ko i whaiwhekau o Pioneer a siasi ko i Jordan River Eastside o Oraki, Auckland. He aho ono si ulai ua hafe taha taha. Lolo taunga ane ngau e whakawhai te kau, ne ne mau e whai ngā mālie o hū ki he api ako tohi tapu Alpha Crisis Bible College. Nā ne whai whaktongia i a Tongan Ethnic Fellowship Assemblies of God i New Zealand ni ko e tauhi paangu. Be ane hoko atu ko te koni taki ke palesteni ana hina sikalu. Be a moe pule ako ke api ako tohi tapu ko e Alpha Crisis Tongan Hub o a oi pe ke he aho ne tali ai hono ui ma o ni uni. Pe ko ia ai ki pili o kalafi o kumau o i mauta mai ko malakai vai pulu. Ko ia pei malu. We come to the most important part of our gathering this morning. And it's my honor again to welcome our National Superintendent of the Assemblies of God New Zealand, Reverend Iliathia Sera, to the podium to uh, share the word with us a final time uh, uh, on our farewell service with the man of God, Malakai Vai Pulu. Good morning. Good morning. I wish we could meet on a better day. <clears throat> Hallelujah. But some days are sad. <clears throat> but we are grateful to God that God is acquainted with grief. We also have hope that our sorrows will turn into joy. Amen. Our tears may endure for the night, yes. but joy comes in the morning. Hallelujah. My name is Ilya Fiesera. I live in Wanganui. I'm Samoan to the bone and out the other side. <laughs> I'm married to Falefioli, who is not able to be here 
We have a conference this coming Friday and Saturday. Uh, she is busy with the conference, organizing it. But she should have come because she is the tongue and part of our family. My wife's part tongue and part German, part Chinese and part Samoan. And uh, she sends her greetings. She sends her condolences to Anna and the family. I want to read again what was read. It was read in Tongan and it was all Tongan to me. So I'll read it in English so I can understand. <laughs> Set me as a seal upon your heart, like a seal upon your hand. For love is as strong as death, jealousy as cruel as the grave. Its flames are flames of fire a most vehement flame. Father, we bless you today. We ask that you bless your word to us and comfort our hearts, we pray. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. <clears throat> the writer of the passage said, set me as a seal in your heart like a seal in your hand. What is a seal? A seal can bond two pieces of material together. A seal also can authenticate a document. You can write a document, but when the king puts his seal on the document, that document is now royal. The Bible says the Holy Spirit seals us unto the day of redemption. Amen. So we are sealed right. by God. Amen. And here, the writer said, set me as a seal. When you get married, you seal your vows with a ring, like this one. Now your ring is on the left hand. My ring is on the right hand. Why? Because I have churches in, in Russia, and in Russia, you put your wedding ring on your right hand. So it helps me seal a covenant with the Russian churches that I can pray for them constantly. Why do I have it in my middle finger? Because it's too big for my other fingers. <laughs> Just to let you know. <laughs> but this seals something. Amen. When you get married, a marriage is sealed by a ring. When you love somebody, you engage to them, it's sealed by a ring. Sometimes it's sealed by a bracelet. Sometimes it's sealed by a necklace. In Maori, things are sealed by a green stone, often hangs from your neck. And if Malachi was here today, I think he might say this to Anna. Anna, I'm going the way of all the earth. We are parted now by death. We made our covenant vows and sealed them with rings. And the vows were until death do us part. I'm now gone. But I want you to do something for me. Set me as a seal. Not on your hand, but a seal in your heart. Amen. Amen. If you seal your hand, you may drop off. But if you seal your heart, it doesn't matter whether it's raining, whether there's a storm at night, in the morning, afternoon, or evening. Seal me. Set me as a seal in your heart. I've loved you all our marriage life. We produce three daughters and I think one son. But I'm going now, but if you want to remember me, set me as a seal in your heart. Amen. Maybe that's what he's saying to his three girls. I won't be able to walk you down the aisle to give your hand to another man. I won't be able to cuddle your children. I'm gone now, but I want you to do something, darlings. I want you to set me in your heart. 
set me as a seal in your heart like a seal in your hand that you will always remember that I am daddy and I have given you everything that I could to equip you for life but set me as a seal Amen. in your hearts. Maybe that's what he's saying to his family, his father, his brothers, sisters, nephews and nieces. Whatever you do, set me as a seal in your heart like a seal in your hand. Maybe that's what he's saying to Anahina. Thank you for the time. Thank you for giving, time, giving me time to serve with you. Thank you to the committee. Thank you for the, to the ethnic fellowship, the Tongan churches. I'm gone now. Thank you for involving me in your lives. Would you set me in your heart? as a seal like a seal in your hand Amen. it says for love is as strong as death <coughs> jealousy as cruel as the grave only you're only jealous because you love if you don't love something, you are not jealous of it. If you don't love somebody, you're not jealous of it. Only those that love understand what jealousy is. The Bible says God is love and God is a jealous God. But it says, set me as a seal in your hand. Like a seal, uh, a seal in your hand, like a seal in your hand. Because love is stronger than death. Or at least as strong as death. That's what it says. Now if death was here. In person. And you ask death. Death. Are you strong? Death will say. Don't ask me. Ask Pastor Malachi. Ask Anna. Ask the girls. Ask the church. Ask the family. Ask them if I'm strong. Because I came and took the love of their hearts and none of them stood against me. And you ask me if I'm strong. You're gathered here today because you come to celebrate the life of a man that I've taken. And you left your jobs. You left whatever you've done to come because I have asked you to come. And you ask me a silly question. Do, am I strong? Of course I'm strong. There is not one here. In a family that is here. That I have not visited. I've killed your kings. I've killed your leaders. I've killed your children. I've killed your brothers. I've killed your husbands and your wives. And you ask me if I'm strong. Are you stupid? Of course I'm strong. And then it says, Love is as strong as death and jealousy as cruel as the grave. If the grave was here, this is the twin, the, the evil terror twin, death and the grave. And if they were here in persons and you ask them that question, you ask the grave, are you jealous? Of course I'm jealous. I don't want anybody to go without punishment. Are you powerful? Of course I'm powerful. How powerful are you? Well, you're going to visit me today in the afternoon. You're going to come and gather around me and put your loved one inside of my belly. And you ask me if I'm strong. If you take a spade and dig up Tomatapu, you'll find me. 
you take the same spade and you go to a pier and dig up a pier, you'll find me. If you go to Suma and dig up Suma, you'll find everywhere you put a spade, you're going to find a grave. Whether it's the Ukraine or Russia or China or Tonga, there are graves everywhere. And if you ask the grave, are you victorious? He said, don't be stupid. Of course I'm victorious. I've got in my belly your children, your loved ones, and you ask me a silly question. And then you, you read what Paul said to the grave and death. He said, death, where is your sting? It's almost like he's defying death and the grave. And then he said, grave, where is your victory? And grave was like, what do you mean victory? From Machpelah, where you buried Abraham, to Calvary, where you buried the Savior of your life. You tell me and ask me a question. Am I victorious? I've been victorious right through history, Grave will say. And Paul still say this? Where is your victory? Death, where is your sting? Hallelujah. Death is stung my family. My mom, my dad, my grandparents, my older sister. And death has stung your family. That's right. We bury people in graves from my family. You bury people in the graves from your family. And yet, the message of the gospel is, to death, where is your sting? The sting of death is sin. But sin is cancelled by the blood. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Sin is cancelled by the blood of Jesus Christ. That's right. It cancels the sting of death to the Tongans, the Fijians, the Samoan, or whatever nationality. You don't have to experience the sting of death because the sting of death is sin and sin is demolished by the blood of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Amen. <clears throat> Grave, where is your victory? Death now becomes the answer. It's the answer to cancer. It's the answer to abuse. It's the answer to everything. That man may have had cancer no longer. There is no more cancer in that man. Amen. Amen. Why? Because death has come and we have turned death around and used death as the answer to the human dilemma. Death is the answer to poverty. Death is the answer to sex trafficking. Because when you're dead, you're no longer hungry, you're no longer in poverty, you're no longer sick. Yes. Death becomes the answer. Christ has turned death Amen. into victory. Amen. Hallelujah. Are you alright? Amen. That's right. Hallelujah. <laughs> I'm sorry my, my voice is I've had a, a little bit of the flu in the last few days. Death is the great equalizer. <clears throat> Equalizes all of us. No discrimination in the cemetery. No discrimination in death. The judge dies, the prisoner dies. The teacher dies, the student dies, the pastor dies, the parishioner dies, men die, women die, children die. We are all equal in death. 
And as we said last night, we may not have a lot to do with death, but if we can prepare to die. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So we can make death work for us. He becomes our servants because if you live to 200 years old, you would want to die. So we use death. Hey, come over. Come over here. This is a loved one. I want you to take them. And Solomon said, the day of death is the greater day than the day of your birth. Amen. Amen. Right. So today, to Malachi, it's a far greater day today for him than the day that he was born. Today is a great day. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Then we use grave. We use the grave. Why? Because we have to store the bodies of our loved ones. And we can't store them at home. We can't store them in the ceiling. We have to find a place to store them. So we go to the grave and open his womb and tell him, you look after my dad until the day Jesus comes and open you up again. So the shout of the apostle is a great shout. It's a shout of hope. Death, where is your sting? Grave, where is your victory? Because Jesus died on Friday. But that was Friday. Sunday is coming. Amen. The devil laughed on Friday. All the demons and devils of hell laughed on Friday. But that was Friday. Sunday is coming. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. They killed the Son of God on Friday. But that was Friday. Sunday is coming. And when Sunday turned up, Amen. the one that they killed walked out of the grave Hallelujah. and conquered death and hell for you and I. Amen. Hallelujah. That if you will live for him, right. then you will never see death. Amen. That's an amazing Hallelujah. thing to say. He said, you'll never see death. Well, what about, he did not say you will never experience death. He said, you'll never see it. So you can experience death and never see death. Yes. Death is an angel. It's a dark angel. The Bible says death will ride the horse and hell will follow him on another horse. When the Christian dies, the Christian will never see the face of that dark angel. Because the angels of God come and take his spirit to heaven we take his body to the grave but the death of a wicked one you're gonna see that angel he's gonna terrorize you but jesus said the hope of the gospel is you can experience death but you will never see the Lord. hallelujah and then he said blessed are those who die in christ even though they are dead they are alive and as we said last night the most alive person in this funeral is the person whose funeral we come to. Even though you're dead, you live. But if you don't know Christ, even though you live, you're dead. There's a lot of dead tongues around here. Malachi is not the dead tongue in here. There are many tongues in the congregation. You're dead. Because if you live for Christ, you'll never see death. If you don't live for Christ, even though you live, that's right, you die. Amen. That's right. Let this day be a day of hope. Hallelujah. And let us be reminded once again of what the scriptures say. Set me as a seal in your heart like a seal in your hand. In a sense, Malachi is closer to us now than ever before. How do we know? He's gone to be with Jesus and Jesus is in us. Let his memory 
Let his life be set in our hearts like the wedding ring in your finger that sets the seal of your marriage vows. Let us pray. Holy Father, we thank you today. You're a good God. Thank you again for the life of an outstanding human being, of a great man, a great father, a great pastor, a husband, a friend, a colleague, a neighbor, an acquaintance. Thank you for giving him as a gift to us for the years that he came. And Lord, we release him to you and thank you for who he was to us. We bless you for that gift. We pray, Lord God, that your comfort will be upon his wife and family, upon all of us. We thank you, Lord Jesus, that you send the Holy Spirit to be our comforter and seal us until the day of redemption. We thank you today. You're a good God. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 I am Elgio Lotto, and I go for a map to go Baba of Ike Hernima. Amen. Amen. I forget that the AT was he has a bigger smile now than when we knew him in person physically. So we rejoice. Hallelujah. Anna, Siosi, Sane, Naise, Line, Richard the Lion Heart. Amen. Your dad is more alive today. Hallelujah. Just keeping him as a seal in your hearts. Amen. Amen. Call it the Hekula Gekia Billy. Gata Yahua may have Tauhiva. The Tau took for Oski Faitoka. The Hua may Tauhiva, the Oskoya, a Mabahe, a Palestinian Turi and a and a Bakuna. Katau hoko hoko kuhende ay hiba hiba. Hangi ko na fahat o ane po oktogi ata wai kumete he tolo. De tau mabahe mehen hewa. De tau mabahe mehen hewa. Koya hoko hoko tupe ay hiba tau ay chorus. Ah, elaba kifai hagahi. Faita po ose malangaya. Kai kai faita. Pea moe Fai nga hiyo wao ko ya Kai kai e hiba Te tau toki hake ko glau Ko e mabahe ay Ko le atpek he ulmo toa Mahanda e uspaka hoka to he wito Ko e fata e pekia Ki he mea lele Paka ha e le E fata ya he fa na wako Alpha cruises tongue and hap Pea e mabahe le Vai mea lele Ki he apino fo anga malakai Kata wole kwa kita utolu otari me waikumete. Eto e kataki pea e fanda wako to hitapu Tom and Hub o frasio siyo e merelehe ne a watu ki waikumete e fata ki hono resting place. So thank you to the family for allowing us the honor of saluting our principal for the last time by carrying his casket, it's an honor. And our, even though we have more women, we have enough men to carry the casket. So um, uh, I hope and I'm, I'm, I'm uh, expecting that all our men are here to carry the casket and uh, salute our principal. But please, Billy and Mahoy, keep us and Ulimi and all the Punakes. Mohua mai tau ngai hiba, ke tau au fia ki hewa. Bihe mana ma ke lahi, te mou hiba ke leo lahi, 
Owing how move at Atta to Siaki move by Yaki for Anga, you move it all. Oh, I get to him at the Koto be here, move him at I mean, like a Kilo, Naya to Matea, I just get home. So use your beautiful voices to sing glory and praises to God while we wait for two o'clock. Malo Alpito, God bless you all.
ก็ไปไปเนี่ยเอาไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไปไ
Elisha. Um,
kita.
que cae, 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 Cata que o bacai que repense para muy muy taja, o que hay taja y o que hay riba, o que riba ella, de tal faja ele a que me afaga el ki, y tu a. Ya que riba está tal que ella, de tal que en agua aquí, y o no faja ele, y o no resting place. Que hay por riba y repense para muy muy, que malo si su, de que o me puna que, o puna que, muy fácil to tono, Kita nak wek aku ni pernah air dia tahu dia pernah air dia, iyo. Malu aku itu hok hok kuat, hok hok kuat pun aku tahu. Tuk siom baik baik he tu, ai tahu awe. Dia tu kena unu baik deh, baik panau tengah tak alpha cruises boleh tahu. Tuk baik mau tahu baik sih tahu, tapi dia tahu dia fikir tu tu tahu pernah air dia, dia pernah air dia. Kau eh taha tong taha ni, aku fok baik he gua. Pekoyo fikiai tau fayo ay pagkaile, alo ang pito. Aleluya. Aleluya. Vaca que caí. Vaca que caí. Aleluya. Aleluya. Vaca que caí. Vaca que caí. Aleluya. Aleluya. Vaca que caí. Vaca que caí. Aleluya. Oh, man. 
Maria, Papeta.